Hello Collective, welcome back to the platform. Thank you for watching as always. Please remember to like, comment, share, subscribe to the YouTube channel. You are greatly appreciated. I am sending you all lots of love, joy, peace, and happiness. Many, many blessings to you and your family. Okay, I return to source. I return to sender. All negative energies and intend immediately and permanently. I call in on the purest of white light and pray that you stay on it. In the purest of vibrational energy and the purest of white light. As I have said, so shall it be. <laughs> Judgment is final. Let's go ahead and get into our terror reading. Okay, I hope you all are doing well, staying blessed, and highly favored always. Okay, so we have uh, someone out here. Your strength, your tenacity is going to be something that awards you heavily. Um, there is something where you, I don't know if like, uh, like someone may have promised you something and a group of people maybe got together and got this person to give this, I don't know what this is, an offer to someone else. Um, they did this because I picked up on this in my previous reading. I think it was at the re one reading ago or two readings ago. And I may have mentioned it. It was either, it was in the last three readings. Listen, this is the nail situation today. We'll get it taken care of after the next two videos. Like, just bear with me. It's been a long day. Um, so anyways, um, someone may have promised you something. And then I think like a group of people came together and tucked this person into giving it to someone else. Or there could be someone who was in competition with you for something you probably weren't even paying attention to. Um, and they may have been taking a lot of malicious and conniving actions behind the scenes to make sure that they get this opportunity. Um, so then once they, I think, got the opportunity, they were maybe trying to rub it in your face. But I, I don't think you care because you're someone that's like focused on something else. Whatever offer this person got, um, it has nothing to do with your calling in life. It has nothing to do with like your pathway. It has nothing to do with you at all. So I think it was possibly nice that someone promised you that, but then there's a reason why it didn't work out for you. Okay. This is for your highest purpose. There's something about this situation that you may not be aware of and the universe is protecting you from receiving that offer. You have a better offer coming in that's going to balance things out for, for you. And this is going to be coming from like a wealthy man that wants to work with you. This could be like your emperor coming in to give you some type of genuine offer. Yeah, this is your emperor. Someone very highly skilled, putting an end to some type of karmic cycle he's going through. So the actual offer you are supposed to receive is going to come from the person you are supposed to receive it from. This person wants to invest in you. There may be a little burden coming towards you because they think you may you may uh, reject them and not see them as wish fulfillment or something like that. It may feel like you see them as a joke, a little boy or something like that. I don't think you see them that way. I think you and someone just have some type of closure that you need to have as far as sitting down and talking. Um, but rest assured, whatever offer this is that a group of people got a masculine or feminine to give to someone else, it has nothing to do with your calling at all. Like literally the universe is protecting you from something you are not aware of. And whoever received this offer, there's going to be some truth exposed about them down, down the line in the future. So I would not pay attention. Don't even worry about it. So if like, if like a father figure, a mom, an auntie, a relative, a standard family, I don't know, whatever this is, even like at work or something, if something was promised to you because I see the Knight of Pentacles out here, if this is something that was at work or just anything in general, where someone promised it to you and give it to someone else, don't worry about it. You will have wish, uh, wish fulfillment. And the offer that was given to someone else, whatever that was that was given to someone else, it's not, it has nothing to do with your calling. You're not missing out on anything. The person that they gave it to doesn't even know what they're doing. Uh, they may even be struggling behind the scenes and they're trying to save face. So your uh, tenacity, as I said in the beginning, is going to pay it off for you. Just stay focused on your pathway. There is someone that's watching you that wants to work with you. They're leaving something out in the cold in order to start brand new with you. Yeah, someone wants to work with you. They're leaving some type of uh, toxicity, some type of old life, some type of old paradigm, possibly an institution or toxic family dynamic, something like that. 
they're leaving it out in the cool to come and work with you and it will be successful. So you, you, is it the universe is literally, the universe is literally protecting you and you don't know it. So right now, some of you may be in this energy, but they're telling you to calm down. You will receive your offer that is meant for you. They, uh, whoever got together and I'm getting like a lot of toxic people that tuck someone into doing something. Um, they may be upset that you're not even bothered about the fact that you didn't receive this opportunity. It's like, I think a group of people may have came together and tried to make you aware that this offer had been given to someone else. And maybe you laughed in the background, just didn't say anything, didn't do anything, but the universe want you to know that you are good. Okay. They are bringing balance in your life. You keep on taking the steps that you need to do and you keep on balancing yourself out. If you are someone spiritual just know that you will be very successful balance will be brought in the situation for you you are heavily protected and everything so you have nothing to worry about again someone could be coming towards you to balance something out and this is going to lead to some type of rebirth some type of tower someone is going through behind the scenes the people there are trying to have you envious or something like that they are going through some type of tower behind the scenes and this is the absolute truth and they may not be happy because what they know that things are going to be balanced out in your life. Again, there goes their two of cups. Someone is taking action to balance something out for you. This could be like a king of wands that's uh, uh, keeping his distance from a possible toxic group, family dynamic, whatever this is. Seeing things from a higher perspective. It's like someone is seeing you for exactly who you are. Like they've gone within to see a situation for what it is. So someone may be coming up with an interesting way to take action in order to come in and give you you some type of offer because they see you as wish fulfillment and they know that you are someone that's very genuine someone very uh nurturing and kind to be around someone very protected this they may see you as wish fulfillment so you two may start off as friends someone is going to be communicating with you so the whole the whole thing is kind of hysterical i know certain times when you all are going through some things that you um like things don't go like you expect them to. It can be disappointing, but the universe wants you to know that you are going to be a okay. You're someone very, uh, um, powerful, someone very gifted, um, and you are supported. Your new beginning is ensured. There's some type of action you may have taken. Maybe you choosing to hold back from someone or something may have created some type of new opportunity for you. So you have nothing to worry about. This is really historical. Um, it says someone is sitting. Um, and watching you from behind the scenes and they're seeing all of the actions people are taking to destroy you or try to destroy you, try to get some type of reaction out of you. And the whole time they see that you're not paying them any mind. You're just focused on yourself, focusing on, you know, balancing your life out, focusing on just your life, not paying attention to any of these people Like you're focused on your dreams and things like that. Um, there's a King of Cups. Um, I don't know if this is like an ex that was working with these people behind the scenes to make sure that you don't receive an offer. And then the person that may have received this offer comes off as a king of cups, but he's not really a king of cups or she's not really a king of cups because, you know, energy is fluid in tarot. So it can be a man or a woman. But whoever this is, is conniving as heck and the truth will be revealed. Someone who has some type of mental imbalance. Uh, someone presents themselves to be in the upright, but they're not. Someone is nothing but a conniving thief. Um, so they basically were going up against you for something you weren't even maybe aware of, or you probably just didn't care. Like you didn't lose any, like you, you're, you weren't in competition. And when you're someone that's healed in life, which it seems that you are with this page of cups out here, you don't compete for anything because you know, everything that's yours will make it to you in divine timing. These very same people are working together to end some type of two of cups offer for you, trying to end your stability. Again, there's a king of cups in here and it keeps coming out in the same order. He is not someone nice. And this is something that's going to be found out about him later on. Uh, someone is going to have to explain why it is they did certain things. Um, to a queen of wands. So you could be, in a be a queen of wands. There's also a queen of wands behind the scenes 
planning something and it's not going to go in her favor. It's like someone is planning to steal something from someone, steal some type of opportunity. Someone is absolutely working with a group of people to plan an ending for you, whether this is a physical ending or some type of financial ending, whatever this is, it's not going to work. There's a queen of swords behind the scenes that's going to be going through some type of ending as well. This person is nothing but a conniving biatch. Um, she is going through some type of loss, but while these people are going through their losses, I'm telling you they're going through losses while they are going through their losses you are the hot topic the, the center of their lives the main focus um so they wanted you to be discouraged it's like they wanted you uh anticipating receiving this news like a commitment or something like that i don't know if this was a commitment in work in love business whatever this is but they interfere and it led to some type of loss but it's not really a loss it's what i'm trying to tell you the universe is protecting you. They're protecting you from something. So thread with caution. Be thankful. Yeah, they are protecting you from some type of ending. Okay? They are protecting you from some type of ending. There could have been some type of setup going on and you don't know it. Okay? Yeah. There is some type of setup going on and you don't know it or this is what was going on and you don't know it. Uh, someone may be about to lose a position as well. Um, this is in like another, I don't know if this is like in a company or something like that, but someone is about to lose some type of position. Um, someone may have paid. I don't know if this is like a boss or whoever this is. They may have paid someone to reject you okay uh i think initially they may have been paying someone or trying to get someone to let you go there's something like that where it's that people want to temper with your stability and again the universe wants you to know that you will successfully put an end to this chapter you will receive your ace of pentacles because you are the choice okay um i think what these people were thinking is that if they got someone to break a promise to you then you wouldn't be receiving the ace of pentacles that is meant for you this is not your ace of pentacles okay that that's the funny thing you know like karmics they'll take actions to like beat you to the punch but a lot of the times the actions they're taking it don't even make sense it's not even applicable to you so they were rushing in to to prevent you from receiving some type of work offer and the whole time they're thinking that they're blocking your ears of pentacles they're blocking your future but the whole time it has nothing to do with you your ears of pentacles nobody knows where where it's going to come from who it's going to come from it is protected and i think i said that in the in said this in the reading that i mentioned this in about a promise or something like that your ears of pentacles is protected and it's being protected from a queen of wands right? She cannot have it. And this has her living in some type of fear that you're going to receive this ace of pentacles, ace of wands, and she's going to be left out in the cold. There's a, there's like a king of wands leaving someone out in the cold because he sees the truth about a situation. He may see the truth about a king of swords as well. It's a lot of characters behind the scenes of you and you're not aware to. And a lot of them are living in some type of anxiety because someone, someone wants to take some type of action to come towards you. Someone does want to work with you. You may not be aware of. Yeah, somebody wants to work with you. But the entire group here, this is something you need to know. The entire group that has been uh, collaborating together to destroy you, guess what's going on with them? Endings. Uh, and why they're going through endings? What are they trying to do? End your independence. End your independence. They want you to martyr yourself. They want you living in anxiety, blocking all new opportunities. They want you out in the cold. Um, that is just not your birthright. Okay. So something will be balanced out. Yeah. Something will absolutely be balanced out, but there is a whole toxic family dynamic behind the scenes that are going through endings and they are uh, pissed off because your future is still secure. It's like these people, they feel like they won't be happy until they see someone out in the street, someone poor, someone homeless, someone rejected, someone isolated, like they want you rejected altogether. There is like a bitter wife energy behind the scenes that is going through some type of tower. Um, and this woman is like bad as ish, IT crazy behind the scenes. She's trying to make sure that someone does not come towards you. You don't receive some type of offer or information. Honey, whatever is meant for you will be given to you. Like someone is crazy out here. All of these people are crazy out here. Basically, what they want is to just destabilize you. They want you rejected, unemployed, and then in some type of mental imprisonment. They may even want to 
bring some type of legal issues to you that has nothing to do with you and it's gonna it's going to uh backfire heavily so i don't know why these people are so committed i actually i mean to why it's a lot it has a lot to do with jealousy it has a lot to do with the fact that i think like a masculine energy may be interested in a feminine energy yeah 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 yeah, yeah. i said a masculine energy may be interested in a feminine energy and the ace of wands a uh, ace of cups came out so someone has a lot of love for you someone has some type of own condition on love for you and they're trying to weigh this man down burden this man to prevent him from coming towards you but guess what you two will be meeting in divine timing and moving on which is going to lead to some type of defeat these people are absolutely determined to block you two from coming uh together i don't know why people are disinvested i think it has a lot to do with money um, so they figure if they block you and someone from coming together, then their money is secure. And again, that's a lie. It's not secure. They're going to lose whatever it is that they think they're protecting. They're going to lose it. Okay. These people have been behind the scenes partying, celebrating. They say, yeah, 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 yeah. We blocked the empress. We blocked the uh, emperor from receiving an offer. We got this person to hold back and keep an offer or give it to someone else. We've blocked their new beginning. They didn't block nothing. Something was not meant for you. <laughs> and you know as a light worker as a star c when something you didn't there's something you didn't know about this this offer position whatever this is there's something you didn't know about it so you are being protected by the universe okay there's some type of position if you will have um received it if you will have a uh, um uh, uh, stepped into that position it would have possibly become some type of nightmare for you because uh someone is about to be like micromanaged and they're not going to like it um i think what i'm hearing is that i don't know if this is a woman because i'm getting like a king of cups but you know the king of cups in tarot it can be man or woman i think someone got accustomed to not doing much so now this they've received this position and they're about to be macromanaged that someone is going to be hovering over someone to make sure they're doing what they're supposed to do and it's going to lead to some type of burden some type of conflict yeah, it's going to lead to some type of conflict because someone uh, is pretending to know what it is they're doing, but they don't know what it is they're doing. Okay, they don't know what it is they're doing. Someone is just pretending. So all of that is going to be going to be exposed because someone is under judgment. They didn't get this position uh, wholeheartedly or uh, morally. There's some things they did behind the scenes that someone may not be aware of, and all of that is going to be illuminated. Um, so. Anyways, while all of that is being illuminated, you're going to be moving on. Your ancestors are all over the situation. Okay, so this is why you're, uh, I, I remember I did a reading a while back and I said something about if like someone pretends to be you or someone is something along that line, just let them, let them keep carrying on their show. Nothing stays in balance in the universe. Everything is always exposed. What's in the dark will always come to the light. So you have nothing to worry about, okay? You will be victorious, okay? You, you are the choice for someone, and they're trying to figure out how to come towards you. They know that you are the truth, right? They do want to invest in you, so they're going to take some type of action to come towards you. They're way down right now because of what people are doing and saying to them. Okay, so this is why they're thinking and thinking and thinking. Someone is afraid that if they invest in you, it's going to lead to endings. So they're thinking about holding back and things like that. But someone is coming out of their state. They're, they're choosing to put an end to this mindset of, oh, if I move forward, it's not going to be successful. If I give them this offer, if I'll choose to work with them. There's someone you're not aware of that wants to work with you and they're going through some type of ending. There's some type of chapter they're going through that they're putting an end to and they're going to make some type of offer to you i'm seeing the ace of pentacles ace of cups and then there's a king of pentacles in here as well i will be mindful of this king of pentacles because there's some type of deception that you may not be aware of so i wouldn't 
really entertain a king of pentacles i think there's a king of wands or someone else behind the scenes that wants to work with you which you will have success with but you too will have some type of mending to do in order to have this brand new passionate beginning ten of pentacles energy and secure your independence or keep your independence okay uh, just be mindful though um, you are being advised to listen to your intuition if two people come towards you to make you an offer do not go with the safer offer you know what uh, when people come in and they're like, oh, you know, your, your job is secure. You get to work nine to five. Um, you have benefits and things like that. Uh, spirit is saying not to go for that. Go for the, the other offer. You will be protected. Something that has to do with business, like you being your own business, being, you doing your own business or you successfully working with someone in business. They are telling you to go, go that route because you will be successful in it. That is the right choice. Uh, for you to make because you're someone very multifaceted again you will be successful victorious okay so you are someone very multifaceted and spirit says that you sitting in an office nine to five uh and just doing that mediocre lifestyle is not meant for you and again i've been told to tell you you are being protected from a situation Due to the fact that you were rejected for, from something, from a position, an offer. I don't know what this is. But whatever it is you were rejected from, it's a protection. You are being protected. And again, whoever received that, they think like they, they defeated you or something. But this is their future in that position. There's going to be some type of conflict. So just keep your mouth shut. Mind your business. Okay? Mind your business. Focus on your new beginning. You see that king of wands there? Someone wants to have a brand new passionate beginning with you and it is, it is going to lead to bounty, success. It could even lead to marriage, okay? Someone is going through some type of ascension behind the scenes. So I wouldn't lose any sleep over what you think you've lost because what? That sucker was going to weigh you down. And there's a king of pentacles that's way down behind the scenes for not giving you some type of offer too. Uh, everybody is going through something behind the scenes. You may not be aware. I'm telling you, you don't know. There's something you're being protected from. So some of you could be sitting around moping around and all kinds of stuff. You may want to move on with your life and keep investing in the things that matters to you. Get out of your head. Okay. Every, every time you are rejected is a protection until you all start to see things that way. You're always going to be bothered by every no. Every rejection is a protection. These people may be celebrating behind the scenes now that they were successfully able to block something for you. They didn't block nothing. It had nothing. It, it was not part of your calling, darling. This is you. You're coming out of all of this madness and staying in your what? Your energy. This is everything they've been trying to do to you behind the scenes. Reject you, isolate you. You don't care about acceptance. Okay. You're on, uh, have you unemployed? The universe wants you to know you are secure. Have you locked up or stuck in your mind? This is your energy. You don't care about any of that stuff those people have going on. You know, like some of the situations where someone would do something to you just to get a reaction out of you and they're sitting there laughing and everything and say, yep, I did that. I, and the whole time you don't really care and you're just, maybe you may even be laughing internally, but you have to be professional and act like you give a damn. It's one of those situations. That's how Source wants you to see that. Okay? That is how Source wants you to see it because the truth will be revealed about some type of action someone was taking behind the scenes or a group of people and it's going to lead to some type of tower. Uh, so, <clears throat> endings, the truth is going to lead to some type of ending for someone. Okay? Someone may not even be aware of the action someone was taking behind the scenes to ensure that they get an offer or uh, whatever offer that was and i don't know why they, I, like someone it's like i'm trying to get away from the offer that was given to someone else but someone wants us to keep talking about that we don't care we have new offers coming in like we're focused on pentacles and blessings and things around here healing right teamwork and things like that investments support and things like that Right? Planning for our future, planning for healing and things like that. But someone wants you to stay focused on something that you didn't receive that was not meant for you. And you not giving a dang about this, right? 
is causing some type of conflict because that was the whole reason and whole purpose of them having this offer being given to someone else is for you to give a damn, but you don't. So it's bothering someone behind the scenes that you don't give two hits. Because <laughs> you know your future is secure and it's coming in quick. You don't, listen, you don't give two hits. That's what I'm talking about. You don't give two hits what this person received or didn't receive. It's a whole toxic group behind the scenes that want you to lose your mind, lose your temper. It's like, you promised me the offer. And you're just like, oh, okay. Like, we already see where this is going. Okay, good luck. They don't want you to be that way. They want you to be disappointed. They want you to feel cast it away but you're out here showing up like i'm here at b-i-t-c-h i'm here <laughs> i'm here <laughs> and they are mad mad and mad <laughs> how are people trying to weigh you down darling and you're out here living your best life it's like i'm living my best life <laughs> i ain't going back and forth with you people i'm giving <laughs> i'm living my best life <laughs> Oh, I'm done. That is too funny. The fact that I'm laughing so much means that there's a collective member of the Soul Tribe sitting and laughing behind the scenes because you see exactly where something is headed and you know exactly what a group of people are doing and you find it hysterical because you know balance is going to be brought in your life. That's hilarious. Someone is laughing at a group of people while they're pissed off behind the scenes because they want you to get have some type of reaction. They want you to feel disappointed that this offer was given to someone else. But you don't care. You say, that don't got nothing to do with me. Okay, I already know who the heck I am. What I have coming. So you can steal all you want. You can do what you want. You can block all you want. What's mine will always be mine. Okay, people want you in some type of impoverished mindset so that they can keep causing illusions and things like that. But the whole time you're like, oh, I, I, I really don't care. I got better things to focus on. I got better things to focus on. They say, you got to pay attention to us. You got to pay attention to us. We took everything from you. You no, 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 no. Well, let's see, collective. I'm sick of your little petty energy. You're out here laughing at these people and they think that they've done something. <laughs> They're pissed off at your success. They're pissed off because you have a you have foresight on where this situation is headed. <laughs> you know exactly what the where this situation is headed you know what they're going through they're burning behind the scenes losing sleep because they know you know your new beginning your offer is still protected but they don't know they don't know how to stop the offer they don't know who it's coming from they don't know when you're going to receive it they may be trying to block a masculine from coming towards you trying to manipulate him and it's not working anymore like someone is like stepping uh, like stern someone is stepping their foot down they're putting their foot down they don't care what a group of people think anymore right and you're go and they still want to work with you i'm telling you you're you're gonna be successful <laughs> yeah. collective i'm gonna need you to stop laughing at these people please <laughs> i feel like i'm picking up on someone's energy and you look at a bunch of people like a bunch of clowns because you already know like your future is secure you're protected as well you're protected as heck you're laughing at a group of people like okay this is enough entertainment for the day but i am <laughs> successful <laughs> you ever had someone start a, a battle with you and they're trying they're trying really hard to defeat you and the whole time you already know, like, <laughs> they ain't no good. <laughs> yeah. You already know they're full of SHIT. <laughs> you already know they're losing their SHIT behind the scenes. <laughs> because you don't care because you know all they do is gaslight. 
Someone knows you see right through them um, and it bothers them. God, yeah, you see right through someone. It's like, I see right through you. You can't fool me. So because you see through someone, they're trying to keep you out of their energy and away from friends, their friends and families because you see right through someone. So they don't want you around. This, oh my gosh. I can't. I cannot. I cannot. Be wary of anyone coming towards you. I'm telling you. Losing their mind. Where is my, oh, where is my independent lady? She had came out earlier. I've been doing this stuff where I keep taking cars out that I shouldn't be taking out. And now I got to find Miss Independent. That's why I love her. Listen, listen, listen. Miss Independent, Nine of Pentacles. Where did you go, girl? Where did you go? You had came out earlier and I took you out. And then I went and put you back. And now I got to find you, my darling. Yeah, there you go. Living your best life. You ain't going back and forth with these ninjas. You're living your best life. Hey. <laughs> There's a woman of, of honor behind the scenes that's pissed off that you're going to be receiving an offer. <laughs> and it's going to bring balance into your life. I'm telling you, it's going to bring balance into your life. She's pissed off. She's like, no, I told you she's not worth it. He's not worth it. Don't give them that offer. And someone's like, I'm moving on. <laughs> no, 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 no. You need to hold back. I don't care. I'm still going forward because I know it's going to be successful. You're trying to have me living in fear, but I know the truth. You're playing with yourself, going through a tower. Your life is over. <laughs> All of these people are way down in burden. I'm telling you, they're going through endings. Rejection. Anxiety. Someone may be sick, losing their mental behind the scenes because of decision. Because of a decision someone has made, right? To see things from a higher perspective, to heal, to self-actualize. They are pissed off. Pissed off. And the whole time they're pissed off, he's holding back. He's like, eh, nah. I don't want that anymore, Elizabeth. That used to be cute. Yeah, 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 yeah. Elizabeth trying to use her body. You said, remember this? You missed this. I know you missed this. You said, eh. Been there, done that. Old news. <laughs> Who is it? Uh, I need to quit playing around. There is definitely a woman out here trying to use her body to seduce a man so he can get back into a karmic cycle with her. And he's out here like, eh, been there, done that, had that already. It's okay. I don't want that no more. <laughs> he's standing his ground <laughs> and being logical about the situation. He said, no, 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 no. I got to take a new path, go somewhere else. I'm going to take my offer to someone else. <laughs> you don't know nothing. I got to go to someone and know something. <laughs> All you do is spread. <laughs> yeah. A brother is out here seeing things from a higher perspective and he's changing, making better decisions in life, seeing things from a higher perspective. <laughs> he's seeing things clearer. The truth has been revealed to him about who he's supposed to be with, where he's supposed to be. No longer blinded, so he's taking action. I'm done. I cannot. I got to get out of this energy because this is like a goofy read. But there's someone, a group of people behind the scenes that are pissed off as heck. Meanwhile, the light workers, star seeds, earth angel babies, indigo baby, indigo child. We be knowing everything and just be sitting there watching people make a fool out of themselves. <laughs> Collected, why are we like this? <laughs> why? <laughs> we be knowing the truth, but just be sitting there like, the, mm, we, 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 we'll know the truth, but just sit there like, mm, that don't got nothing to do with me. <laughs> You're you going to learn today. Because <laughs> when this is over, everybody go night-night. Everybody go night-night. I got to get out of this reading. Why is it so goofy? I can't. Everybody's about to go night-night. The whole group. <laughs> ah, oh, their secrets are out. The truth is out about a union. And someone is seeing things from a higher perspective. So they're leaving the community behind. Taking a new path. Standing their ground. 
to ensure their own victory. <laughs> listen, listen, listen. Listen, Linda, Linda, listen. The lies ain't lying no more. The manipulation ain't manipulating no more. I can't. I cannot listen. I have got to get out of this energy. This is too goofy. Listen, let me. Listen. <laughs> Oh, you may have, there may be a king of pentacles in here that wanted to give to you, but cannot because you see right through this person. They pay someone to uh, break a promise or something like that, or they try to get someone to break a promise. He's standing his ground. I don't know who this is. This could be another king of pentacles, but someone is standing their ground. <laughs> she she to a, to, to a, some type of deceit. No, 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 Linda. I see right through ya. <laughs> no, 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 Linda. No. Someone has been lying a lot. They're way down. Yeah, someone sees the truth. They see the truth. They're trying to block someone's intellect, someone's knowledge, and everybody's under judgment. Everybody's headed to some type of poverty. Listen, poverty is, poverty is the road that lies ahead for a group of people and they don't know it. This will be the idiots that oh, something will be going on. They'll be doing something. And because no type of repercussion has come out yet, they'll be like, oh, well, nothing has happened to me yet. I've been doing this for four years. I've been doing this for six years. Nothing has happened. And then the truth come out. Oh, and it's, it's silence of the lamp. It's that, oh, wait, remember you thought you had blocked someone's new beginning? You have blocked someone's offer. What was this? What is this? What had you said again? Now that I am heartbroken because you're still receiving a new beginning, new offer. Baby, it is mad, mad. This is mad, mad that someone is going for it. They're advocating for you. Okay. They said, no, 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 no. Don't go towards him. Don't go towards her. We told you. We told you. They're no good. They're no good. Okay. 